How to Activate the Presence of the Holy Spirit, Part 5, by Duodu Henry Apayakorang. Life's journey often steers us through storms and trials, shaping us into leaders capable of guiding others through similar challenges. These trials, though difficult, serve as building blocks for our character and creativity. Just as Christ Jesus endured suffering and grew in wisdom, we too must navigate life's pains to mature spiritually. Embracing life's challenges empowers us to understand and empathize with others. It's through these experiences that we grow, shedding our childish tendencies and embracing a mature perspective. Christ himself exemplified this, enduring trials and ultimately emerging victorious, a testament to the transformative power of suffering. Yet, amid life's trials, Christ offers us hope and salvation. His enduring presence illuminates the darkest corners of our lives, offering peace, joy, and eternal rewards. Through him, we find purpose and meaning, transcending the fleeting treasures of this world. Central to experiencing the fullness of Christ's presence is our connection with the Holy Spirit. Often overlooked or misunderstood, the Holy Spirit is our guide and comforter, leading us into a deeper understanding of God's will. However, many believers fail to activate the Holy Spirit's power in their lives, unaware of the simple steps needed to do so. One such step is embracing the transformative power of love. As the Apostle Paul eloquently states, love transcends all spiritual gifts, serving as the foundation upon which our faith is built. True love, unconditional and sacrificial, is a hallmark of Christ's teachings, and it is through this love that we invite the Holy Spirit to work within us. Creating an atmosphere of love within our communities and churches is paramount to activating the Holy Spirit's presence. When genuine love permeates our interactions, the Holy Spirit flourishes, guiding us towards unity and spiritual growth. Conversely, discord and division are antithetical to the Spirit's work, hindering His transformative power. To express this love authentically, we must emulate Christ's example, serving others selflessly and sacrificially. Whether through acts of charity, support for fellow believers, or obedience to God's Word, every action rooted in love invites the Holy Spirit to dwell within us. In conclusion, activating the presence of the Holy Spirit requires a heart overflowing with love. As we embody Christ's love in our daily lives, we create fertile ground for the Spirit to work miracles in and through us. Let us, therefore, embrace love wholeheartedly, knowing that through it, we welcome the abiding presence of our Lord and Comforter, the Holy Spirit. Freely download and read Duodu Henry Apayakorang books on his blog and Amazon for more profound revelations. Check out his blog, www.rockofheaven.com for more profound revelations. Kindly share the link of this video to save a life.